Hi everybody, this is Shirley from Ordinary Greatness and a life coach with the Healthy, Wealthy and Wise organization. You know, 50 years ago I was almost two and when we look back in the history books, we're almost in the same position we were then. We're still afraid of our government and our law enforcement. We're still protesting for equality. Um, we still worship bad people who make bad decisions for bad reasons and they become heroes. There's still sexism, racism, and scare tactics to keep us depressed and in our place. So I'm just saying, with all of these things going on in the world today, 50 years later, um, does it affect you? Are you angry? Do you care? And if so, what are you doing about it? Or do you care to do anything about it? Now, I'm not judging. I'm just asking because some people are just happy where they are. I personally am not. Uh, I want to leave this place a better place when I'm gone. So I've got to find places and people that will help me do the work uh, that I eventually want to get done. And so I'm proud to say that I've done many things, um, but none of them by myself. And if we think we can do things by ourselves, that's stinking thinking. And you just have to get that out of your way. Um, I've learned to eat better, read more, understand government and politics more than I want to, uh, understand the FDA, the USDA, and the EPA, which is really scary. And uh, I now truly understand a lot more things than I did even 10 years ago. But more importantly, um, I now know money and I understand money and I know you said oh you owned a business whoopie do I owned a business what does that mean that I took a chance and you can take that chance too uh, I took a chance on an opportunity and I won some and I lost some but the really cool thing is that what I've learned from it is that um, money doesn't make me I make the money but it does take money to make money and we have to be serious about that I've been on many venture adventures and I've detached myself from the outcome and um, I'm glad that I did because what I learned, I brought back and I shared with people. We call that networking. Um, naysayers call it show off. Um, I have nothing to show off, but what I do is I bring back hope and opportunity from what I've learned from where I've traveled or the people I've met and sat around at a table with. Uh, so I come back and I sell hope um, and I share the opportunity with them to be able to do the same thing or create their own ideas from it because we all have our own little personal greatness inside of us. It's just how you get roughed up in your journey that brings you to where you need to be. So I'm just curious, do you have a place to go to talk to people about your dreams and to brainstorm with and to get out of your comfort zone but in a safe arena to work on that beautiful mind of yours you know as a 25 year entrepreneur I can say that I see people go to work every day and help others live their dreams who's helping you live your dreams and when you get in that car you're taking a chance that you're gonna have safe travels there for someone else how about take a chance on yourself. I'm looking for like-minded people who are tired of being playing it safe, tired of being under the, the radar, and want to become lifetime learners and earners. And the cool thing is you are the product. And you get to invest in you without any guilt and shame because, you know, we do a lot of things and then we feel guilty about it. So the side effects would be uh, abundance, love, and spiritual freedom. And you know the beach every now and then if that's what you'd like. So go to www.wealthitforward.com. And if it's something that piques your interest and you're sick and tired and you're looking for something different or you want to try other things, then we're the people to see. Talk to you soon.